Right, this is a good one, you know. So a man asked, my parents, well, a man said, my parents have been sabotaging my life since I was born. Any advice how to escape? Got 10 to 20K right now. I mean, you just got a room. If, if it's that bad where you cannot live there, uh, because it's, and I don't like to talk about taking a toll on your mental health, but if it's that bad, go and rent in a room. Go and get a room share in that. But, you know, if you was able to save up 10 to 20K, are your parents really sabotaging your life that much? You understand what I'm trying to say? Is things that bad? Because I've never heard of someone living a fucked up life that's got 10 to 20K saved in a bank. Tell, tell me a crackhead. Tell me some drug addict that's got 10 to 20K saved up in their banks. Show me some homeless person that's got 10 to 20K saved up in their bank account. Right now. So is your life really that bad? Are they really trying to sabotage your life that much? Please explain. What is it? Because I know there's a lot of parents out here. They don't want to see us succeed. Trust me. Unfortunately, some of us have parents out here who they don't want us to do better than us. I've seen it. I've seen it. It, it, it could be in anything. When I go back to my mom's yard and that, she usually, maybe not for a long time, but she was watching that night, uh, not 90 Day Fiance, Say Yes to the Dress program, yeah, where women, they go on, um, you know, go and buy their wedding dress and that. And you know, some of the mums, are trying to out-compete their daughter, you know, saying that, ah, oh, my wedding dress was better than yours. Or they can see that the daughter likes the wedding dress, but they're telling her, nah, don't go for it. Now, you can see it. And I know someone who did get married. And obviously, this program is in America, but I know someone that did get married, and they were saying that their mum was trying to steal the limelight on their wedding day. And that. It's like, yo, it, yeah, it's supposed to be your daughter's big day. Why are you trying to steal, steal the limelight? So unfortunately, we have parents, some of us have parents that try to, quote unquote, sabotage our lifestyle or our life, or, you know, they don't want us to do better than them. There's parents out here who are jealous of their children. For what fucking reason? I don't know. I want my son to be better than me in every single fucking metric. I want him to be taller than me, better looking than me, earn more money than me, be more intelligent than me, be faster, stronger. Obviously, if my son tries to thing, I'll pick him up and smack him up and dash him on the floor and that, obviously. But still, 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 I want my son to be better than me. This is how we got to the stage that we're at as a human race. Because on a long enough time scale, the, the more recent generations, the, the next generations outcompeted and were better than the previous generation. But obviously, the next generation obviously needed the knowledge from the previous generation and that. But if you're trying to sabotage your child's life and that, you obviously don't want them to be better than you. If everyone had that mentality, yeah, let's sabotage things for the next generation and that, well, we'll still be in the plains of Africa for black people or in the cave for white people. Rubbing sticks and stones trying to create fire and that. So it's just a crazy mentality in that. But yeah, please elaborate on, let me see if I can.